One of the most annoying things about editing videos is having to cut out all the gaps and failed takes in script recordings. So instead of spending a few minutes doing this manually, I spent a few hours making a Python script so I can automate the process and get it done in just a few seconds. The first thing I did is create a new Python script and import a library that can analyze audio. Then I made a script to take an audio file as input and cut it into chunks. Then the script analyzed each chunk's volume and marked the ones that required of an average to be deleted. I wrote some code to display graphs of the audio as well as what chunks were safe and what chunks needed to be deleted. Then I imported a video editing library called MoviePy and told it to remove all the chunks that were quieter than usual. This all worked great and the script outputted audio that cut out all the silence and only contained the parts where someone was speaking. This wasn't even too hard to program, but this wasn't my entire goal with this project. I also wanted to have my script remove any failed takes that it hears in my audio recordings. To accomplish this, I needed a way to translate the entire audio into text, then read each sentence compare it with the ones before it. If the script found two sentences that were very similar, it removed the first one and kept the last take. This worked great in theory, but now I needed a way to turn it into an actual program. So I made a new script and imported a speech-to-text library, then got it to run on the input audio. Then it split the audio into sentences and looped through every sentence to try and find duplicates. This would have worked great if not for the fact that the speech-to-text library I was using kept glitching every time I heard a duplicate sentence for some reason. This was incredibly annoying, but I came up with a super janky solution that actually worked. Firstly, the input audio was ran through the first script that removed all the quiet points. I made some modifications to the script so instead of deleting the quiet audio, it would cut the video there and export each part as a separate clip. Then I got the text-to-speech program to run on each one of these clips individually. This stopped it from glitching because there was only translating a small section of audio at a time, and the glitch only seemed to happen when it was running on multiple duplicate sentences. After my script had every sentence translated into text, it ran a loop on every sentence to compare it to its neighbors, and if it found a duplicate, it deleted the original and kept the latest one. After that, it just compiled all the remaining videos into one movie. At this point, the project was complete, but I also wanted to add a simple UI to make it easier to use. This was really easy and I used a library called PySimpleGUI to do this. After that everything was finished and if you want to see it working well you have been this entire video. This is the Premiere Pro timeline for this video and as you can see the audio is only a few cuts. This is because my program automatically removed all the failed takes and blank spots in the audio. Unfortunately it isn't perfect and sometimes it does slip up so I have to edit some parts out but overall it works really well and saves a lot of time. Here's a timeline from another one of my videos as a comparison and you can clearly see that it saved me a lot of time. Anyway thanks for watching and until next time goodbye. Bye.